Kia ora guys! How's it going? It's Maria here with another React video. I noticed today that Nigel Ung posted a new Uncle Roger video, so I'm here for that. I just wanted to uh, address a couple of things. First things, why is my hair short? Someone wrote a comment on one of my videos saying, are you recovering from something? Not, oh well, yeah, uh, no, not like that. <laughs> Maybe recovering from a decision that I made to chop all my hair off, yes. Uh, so in May of this year, I decided that I wanted to shave my hair off and I did it and raised a whole bunch of money for three kids charities here in New Zealand. I think we raised about $15,000, which is huge for me. I mean, it's not a small amount of money. Uh, and I haven't grown it back because I kind of like it. I have a lot of hair. I have very thick wavy hair and I've wanted to experience one summer with short hair. So that's what I'm going to do and then I'm going to grow it back. Uh, what was the second thing I wanted to talk about? I don't know. My kids are back at school. So today's the first day. I'm excited. I love my kids and I love the school holidays. I love the relaxed schedule. I just love everything about it. But they were bickering. They were fighting. They were ready to go back. Although they weren't. They want to stay at home. But I'm ready. Anyway, I'm going to react to... Oh, 97% uh, of people who watch this don't subscribe to me. And I know that you might be like, why the fuck would I subscribe to you? <clears throat> just give me a chance, okay? I'm a mum with no direction in her life reacting to videos on the internet because I don't know what else to do. So let's follow that train work and see where it goes. <laughs> okay, let's start the reaction video. I've got a cup of coffee here. I've got my social media on mute. Hopefully we can get this going. Okay, 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 let's do this. When we say fire rice, we don't mean you deep fry the rice. Oh my god, Visible you're killing confusion. me, <laughs> Mimi. Hello, niece and nephew. Hello. It's Uncle Roger. Hey, Uncle, Uncle Roger. Roger realized there is this new wonderful form of joke called a Mimi. Mimi. Just yesterday, <laughs> Uncle Roger don't know what Mimi is, but... I remember thinking a long time ago, like a couple of years ago, maybe like five or six years ago, what the hell is a Mimi? I remember thinking about that the other day. And in Māori, Mimi means <laughs> to do a wee, <clears throat> but it's M-I-M-I. -I. So, yeah, anyway, meme is way better. <laughs> I discovered this wonderful page called Uncle Roger Mimi's so Mimi's. funny. Uncle Roger laughs so much. So today, Uncle Roger gonna react to niece and nephew Mimi of Uncle Mimi. Roger. Some are good, some oh, are terrible. I feel sad for your life. Hiya. You make unfunny Mimi. That is the saddest life. Why don't you get a day job? Do some. Okay, can I just interject very quickly, and I'm sorry for pausing it. But if you guys don't follow... um. Is it called Rice to Meet You? It's the Rice to Meet You podcast. It's the podcast that Nigel Ung and his friend Evelyn do together. It is hilarious. And you get to see, um, like, behind the scenes. But also, you get to see Nigel for himself. And he's so quick-witted. Like, him and Evelyn do a great job together. Anyway, anyway. Shot Maria. Something that contribute to society. Niece and nephew, make sure you watch till the end of video because Uncle Roger gonna make my own Mimi for all of you. I show you how to do it properly. How to make really funny Mimi. <laughs> oh, this is classic Mimi <laughs> format. The trick Mimi. Uncle Roger, I say no to cooking without MSG. Yeah. Say yes to cooking with <laughs> MSG. Okay, this one classic. Uncle Roger, understand? I like this Mimi because Trick copying Uncle Roger. He wear orange jacket. Trick <laughs> mm, got good taste. Good taste. Uncle Roger think I am very different from Trick because I started from the bottom and now I still at bottom. <laughs> I, uh... <laughs> Okay, God addict explosion God to Eddie. 2020. Satan. This Mimi, <laughs> Uncle Roger don't get. Why they call me Satan? Why they call Auntie Hirsch a God? It should be the other way around. <laughs> Not funny. Next. <laughs> Gordon Ramsay say this smell amazing. Me, that look tasty. Uncle Roger say that look disgusting. Me, that look disgusting. <laughs> then my face in a smug expression. <laughs> okay, I think this be me trying to say Uncle Roger opinion. Always correct. And that is true, but the maker of this Mimi is so sloppy. Look at the third line, Uncle Roger, Roger. When yeah. you make Mimi, please proofread your Mimi before posting. He's Hiya, right. Hiya. 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 Hi
My plan 2020. <laughs> ah, this is good Mimi. This Mimi is so simple. Only three words but convey so much. <laughs> to be honest, this is not Auntie Hersha fault. Auntie Hersha only presenting recipe by BBC right. Food. And now niece and nephew, we all know BBC stands for bad bad cooking. <laughs> Uncle Roger want to update this meme, make it more accurate. I will change it to something like this. Good meme, good meme. What do we say to the god of death? Hiya! <laughs> this meme is okay. I think when Asian people die, we always say hiya because we always have things we forget to do, like turning off the light bulb in house. When Uncle Roger died, I see green reaper. Lightning. First thing I say is hiya! I left all the light in my house on. Lightning. So sad. Not my Lightning, come here. Electricity bill so big. Green Reaper, are you gonna pay Uncle Roger electric bill? I want to save money. I don't want to die yet. When you become middle-aged uncle like me, your only hobby middle now yeah. is turning off all the light in house. Please <laughs> and nephew, you don't even need light sometimes. Take away all your light bulb. Save money. Get all your shit done in the morning. After 6 p.m., no light. Just sit in darkness, staring at corner of room. This is what Uncle Roger do every day. By the way, ignore the light back here. I know you see light back there, but that is light for YouTube video. That is not Uncle Roger forgetting to turn off uh. the light. Speaking of YouTube backdrop, Uncle Roger found this new hand-waving cat. It uh. brings Uncle Roger good luck, luck. and the yeah. design so pity. What you think? Please and nephew, leave comment. Do you like this cat? This is my favorite thing I own now. If fire break out in Uncle Roger hotel room right now, this is only thing I say. Fuck passport. Fuck ID card. <laughs> this is only thing I need. Stop. <laughs> Next meme. Ed. Do. No, 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 is this what they fuck? <laughs> when we say fried rice, we don't mean you deep fry the rice. I oh think that my looks like god, you're bike. killing me, <laughs> Mimi. Why are you torturing the rice? Oh no, Uncle Roger, <laughs> heartbroken. Okay, this one. I think this is not Mimi. This Hi. is just poem. How you don't wash the rice, just cook the rice, the rice stinky like you. They just lifted Uncle Roger quote from Uncle Roger own video. And you call this Mimi? Put some effort into your Mimi. Yeah. This is not Mimi. <clears throat> but this is actually good poem. Uncle Roger is the Shakespeare of rice. <laughs> Shall I compare thee to an egg fire rice? <laughs> so up more lovely and more nice. Totally like Shakespeare. You can't tell the difference. Oh, Ooh. this is Ikea advert using Uncle Roger. It say, for the perfect egg fire rice, $39.90. Ikea, Colin did not require it. Uncle Roger line in your ad. You didn't even pay Uncle Roger. Hiya. Nobody go to Ikea to buy what? Real work you find Chinese. in basement yeah. of Chinese grocery store. Yes. Not next to Billy bookcase. Mm. IKEA only good for meatball and free pencil. <laughs> Uncle Roger loves stealing free pencil from IKEA. That is the only pencil Uncle Roger used. Growing up, I don't even have sharpener. I run out of pencil, <laughs> I go to IKEA. <laughs> so simple. Next, there was Uncle Ben's rice in that house. <laughs> it's gone now. <laughs> yeah. I think this is crime worth committing. <laughs> never gonna give you up, never gonna let you down, and then a bag of MSG. Okay, this is good Mimi. Uncle Roger see the concept, very nice execution. My ex-wife Auntie Helen is opposite of MSG. She give me up and let me down. I think Uncle Roger got Rick rolled by her. Rick -rolled. <laughs> You know you really fucked up when Uncle Roger put his foot down. That is so correct. In Uncle Roger Asian life, this is most comfortable way to sit. I sit like this, I feel like a king. If you make Uncle Roger put leg down from chair, you know you fucked up. Okay, this one is comic strip. I killed a man. You? I used metal spoon on a long stick pen. 
Oh, this means so <laughs> much because I think using metal spoon on non-stick pan is worse than murder. If you murder your friend, you can always get new fan. Just go do Tai Chi in the park or go play mahjong with old Asian auntie. New fan is there, but a good walk is so hard to find. The walk go old with you. Asian people, we love our cooking utensil more than we love fan. Uncle Roger, one time, I had housemate who ruined my rice cooker bowl. He used metal spoon on my non-stick rice cooker bowl. Nobody know where that housemate is anymore. Yeah. <laughs> Uncle Roger playing with Uncle Gordon uh, and Auntie Roger. Jamie Oliver <laughs> Exactly. exactly. So many people shipping Uncle Roger and Auntie Hersha. But I just want to say, please stop shipping us. Yeah. Auntie Hersha has been so scary. Uncle Roger want to stay alive. Do you even know what you're doing? The girl say to the guy. Uncle Roger say use finger ah. to make man satisfied. This meme is so dirty. <laughs> Uncle Roger is family friendly character. Niece and nephew, don't make dirty meme like this. Uncle Roger got so many young fans. I don't want to explain what this meme means. <laughs> and also, the finger method is different. When you cook rice, you use finger method. Come up to first, first knuckle, joint. first joint, joint finger. <laughs> when you use finger method on people, it's not just first knuckle, <laughs> it's the whole fist. <laughs> Sorry, children. <laughs> when you at grandma's house for dinner and you tell her you can't eat all the food she prepared, so weak Asian grandma love force feeding you and then they also love to complain you fat. They are very mysterious creatures. <laughs> this is another comic strip Mimi. Baby is born. I have never loved anything as much as I love you, son. And the son say, I strain rice with pollen though. The son get thrown away. This is good parenting. When you are adopted. This is why. You told your parents you strain rice with colander. <laughs> That's why they give you up. If you strain rice with colander, you become garbage. 1.69 million Ooh. subscribers. Nice. Why 69 nice? Uncle Roger, don't get this meme. I too innocent. Rice guy, <laughs> <in> no <laughs> MS. <laughs> <laughs> Zip you nude. I'm not the best. <laughs> G, wait a minute. <laughs> Hiya. When Uncle Roger applied job at Rice yeah, Guy, I didn't, didn't get know. to see the truck. I don't know they don't use MSG. So sad. If Uncle Roger knew, I wouldn't have gone work for them. Oh yeah, baby. Tell me what you want. Talk to me like you a fucking idiot. <laughs> I use colander to drain rice. Oh, this meme quite funny. <laughs> Uncle Roger like. The nurse explaining that life support has been cut off. Me who just plugged in my rice cooker. My mom. I know what this meme is trying to say. So it is your relative in hospital. He on life support, but you want to cook rice. So you unplug the life support and plug in your rice cooker. <sighs> That's what Uncle Roger did to my great grandpa. Next time when I go to hospital, I gonna bring extension cord. <laughs> okay, now Uncle Roger gonna make my own meme. When you see this meme, you're gonna say, Fui yo, this Fui yo. meme is so funny. Uncle Roger, genius meme maker. See? This Mimi, so funny. <laughs> Distracted boyfriend Mimi. He yes. have saucepan as girlfriend, but he see the beautiful rice cooker. Yeah. So funny, this Mimi. What you think? What you think? Also, Uncle Roger actually made two Mimi. Distracted boyfriend again. First knuckle, and then whole fist. Mm. <laughs> if you like Uncle Roger Mimi, go on Instagram, follow this page, at Aww, Uncle that's Roger nice. Mimi's, and submit your own Mimi. Uncle Roger want to see all the Mimi niece and nephew created, That's and nice. then I want to judge you. Proofread your Mimi before you post. Yeah. Don't be idiot. <laughs> see you in my next video. Bye bye. Oh, that was good. Okay, let's pause it. Make sure there's nothing at the end. Where's the outtakes, boy? Mm, when we say fly ah. right. Okay, let's get back to here. Well, that was really good. I like a good meme. That makes it sound fucked and fucking weird. Sorry. <clears throat> I enjoy memes. Um, actually, that's pretty much what keeps me going during any depressive state that I have. Which is my entire fucking life sometimes. Um, but whatever keeps you happy. <laughs> I am really enjoying Nigel Ung and his characters. Uh, again, I highly recommend you guys go check out his podcast, Rise to Meet You with Evelyn. I'm not sure what her last name is. But they are a great team together. I really enjoy their content. Um, again, if you've made it this far, thank you. I would love you to subscribe. Uh, I have a really cool video coming up of a behind the scenes um, 
my words. Do I know how to speak English? I filmed an ad. I filmed my first TV commercial. I've done ads before, but not TV commercials. And I got, I, I was very lucky to get asked to do it. So yeah, me, this weirdo from New Zealand. Uh, so I've got a behind the scenes. It's just getting pre-approved by the client at the moment. Um, my agency's working on that. So I would love you to subscribe and then you can see it when it comes out. So yeah, thanks guys. See you in the next video. Fuck, make it awkward, you dipshit.